the front pannier adapters attach to your globe's fork and fender struts. They provide the attachment points necessary for panniers and side bags, including the cool cave. You will need the small torque wrench that came with your bike, with the 3 and 4 mm bits. This video is a visual aid to be used with the detailed assembly guide. Front wheel removal is necessary when using the provided tools. As shown in the wheel removal and replacement video, it is best to turn the bike over on the saddle and bars for easier installation. Slide a washer and a short spacer onto a 30 mm bolt. Do this for three bolts. Get another three short spacers ready. Insert the bolt assembly through the adapter rack with the small spacer between the rack and the fork mount. Thread in loosely by hand. Repeat for the remaining two fork mounts, leaving all the bolts a little loose. Be sure the rack mount tabs face inwards towards the fork. Slide a washer and spacer onto the 30 millimeter bolt. Get two long spacers ready and slide a washer and short spacer onto two 25 millimeter bolts. Insert the 30 millimeter bolt through the rack assembly and thread into the long spacer. Take the 25 millimeter bolt assembly and thread it in loosely from the back side of the strut into the long spacer. Repeat for the middle fender mount. Note that the third hole down here will not be used. Use the torque wrench with the 4 millimeter bit to tighten both the inner bolts to 6.2 newton meters. Use the torque wrench with the 3 millimeter bit to tighten all the other bolts to 5 newton meters. That's great! Now follow the same steps in the same order for the assembly on the other side. The wheel removal and replacement video showed you how to reinstall the front wheel. Cargo on the fork can be very stable and easy to maneuver, so long as you don't overload it. The weight limit is 18 pounds per side.